I'm gonna have to multitask here so I don't miss a turn, but we'll do, figure it out. No, I got it on, I got a GPS on. The off season always kind of flies by, but when you drive in, you know, Arlington's buzzing, you realize how much you missed it here, and it's a great feeling to have a place like that that you're fortunate enough to, to come back to every year. There's lots of stuff to do, so that's great. I mean, Georgetown is a rock's throw away too, so. A rock's throw? Stone's throw, rock's throw. Maybe I screwed it up, but <laughs> it's hard. Hey, my, my sayings are rusty after the summer. Bashes, locally owned boxing based fitness studio in Arlington. He's definitely very invested in the Arlington community, and I think that's what also drew him to Bash, is it's a locally owned, homegrown brand. What's going on here? We're yeah. doing really well. The summer was probably, I mean, it was the best two months we've had here. Yeah. Like, they've helped me kind of learn the business side of it. It was taking off before the summer, and now to come back and see that it's done so well and only kept climbing, it's not really a surprise because of the people behind it pushing it and growing it. The Ballston studio is opening in a week, so we're really excited about that. It's you know the second location. We're, we're really pumped about it. Okay, thanks, guys. Bye. Okay, bye. We're just leaving Roslyn. As you spend more time here, it certainly feels like home, and I love it. It's a good balance of off-ice stuff, on-ice, fans are great, city's awesome, always something to do for relatives that are visiting. So last year we did Christmas, which was nice. Everyone came down. But Taylor, my girlfriend, is uh, she'll be living here for the first time, and she's going to George Washington to do her MBA. She got into a business school there but she loves it here too, so she's going to school, she's getting involved in the community, and it'll be a fun year. She'll probably be as busy as me, which will be make for, you know, probably the odd stress fight or whatever, but it'll be, it'll be good. <laughs> I'm sure she'll be, you'll see some more of her this year. I think at the beginning of your career, it's tough to dive into stuff off the ice because the NHL is such a tough league to crack as a young player. So I think you find a lot of the players get their bearings and then from there they have the time to give back to the community a little bit more once things slow down and you get more comfortable. Nice to meet you. Skyler. Skyler, nice to meet you. I got some shirts for you. 43's Friends has been great. Last year we hosted families from Make-A-Wish. Um, just to kind of give them the opportunity to, to have a fun night and uh, let go of all the kind of the unfortunate stuff that may be going on in their life that they're, uh, that they're battling with. What's your favorite animal? I would say dogs, but that's too easy, right? Everybody likes dogs. I think wolves are cool. Like, I you know, like a wolf or... That's still a dog. That's still a dog? It doesn't count? <laughs> and we're just, we wanted to expand it a little bit to military families, so we'll be hosting military families. The same premise, just to get the family out. I've gotten to know some some friends that have served and they're amazing people. You know, they do the toughest job in the world, so anything that we can do to help is great. How do you make friends? How do I make friends? Well, usually you learn how to do that in like grade three or something, but. When you're here for a long period of time, you run into some pretty cool people and you make friends and you build relationships, but you, you definitely spend the most time with your teammates, that kind of small circle. Over the last year or so, we've been involved in helping Henley Elementary and helping the kids with a more enjoyable space to learn and be kids. And, and a lot of them, when we first went in there, they're like, you know, they're, what's hockey? And, what is the Stanley, what's the Stanley Cup? Who are you? Does anybody know what ice hockey is? We're working on it. You know? Always nice to, to give back, be a part of it. It's always fun. Yeah, until I got iced last year by the one kid on a high five. I went down the line with the last kid. I was like, uh, but you know, that's what's fun with kids is there's so many different like, personalities and attitudes and that's why I think we we like being involved in this kind of stuff is because they they just want to be kids and they want to have fun and anything we can do to to make their days better and, and more enjoyable it's uh it's fun 
this is kind of the last day with the past year of work. I know um, So Kids can raise a bunch of money and it did awesome. So we're pretty excited and it'll be good to get back and see everybody there and we're happy and hopefully the kids will be too. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this. You think I'm driving a Mini Cooper? I already did two parallel parks on camera today. <laughs> Nailed it. Hopefully I didn't speak too soon. I did speak too soon, I think. I got cocky. It's on an angle, too. Hi, how are you? Good. Where are the other Good. guys? I'm early. Yeah, you're early. They're supposed to be here. At... There he is. Oh. See, that's a vehicle that's made for off-roading. Holtz is the man. So someone else can, yeah, you, sh so you should so go Nicholas. get this on film. So Nicholas can park. Wow. Are you sure? Because it's really at an angle. <laughs> the Jeep does it all just like Holtz. I was trying to make a spot for Nick. He's being a good Nick. teammate. He just had to park. Then Nick found just the perfect spot right in the front, so now I'm on a hill. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, Nick. Hey, camera. Oh, I had no idea. Yeah. Just now? Yeah. No. Oh, well, it looks good. It's not small at all. Yeah. Yeah. It looks it's, good. It's amazing. It's sore, eh? It's, it's all right. Like. All happy, really? So, Mine was so bad. So, um, you guys awesome. ready? Yeah, let's do it. All right, right. Yeah. let's do it. So I'm getting a sweat going. Oh, I'm gonna need someone that's taller than me. <laughs> Bring the wizards in to finish it off. Right Finishing touches. Yeah. Thanks, Thank guys. you. Awesome. Thank yeah, you. good job. They helped us raise money for the gym. Yeah. And we're really thankful for that. Yeah, really. Yeah. We did some painting. Put uh, together some bleachers. And then read a, read a book. Yeah, read that was really good. Yeah. Yeah. So this is Tom Wilson. Hi, guys. Lots of. Uh, Lots of fun kids, lots of energy, so it's been good. How's the bag? What's in there? Some books? Yes. I like Kung Fu Panda. Kung Fu Panda? Wow. I want the Panda. Nailed it. Do you know your foundation's letter keyword sounds? Yeah. Okay, so if you point to the letter, can you give him the letter keyword sound? Because I don't think he knows it. I don't know it. You know all three, right? The letter, the picture, and the sound. Ready? Go. C-Cat. Wow. A-Apple-I. Yeah, I mean, the first graders were yeah. dialed in. Yeah, they were. No, boy. <laughs> Unreal. I want to stay in this well class done. all day. Yeah. This is too you fun. You guys are having fun. That's what it's all about. <laughs> awesome. They're looking good. All right, guys. All the keep up the good work. Yeah, yeah good job. That was Thank amazing. Thank you very much for having us yeah. here. Bye, guys. You're welcome. Bye. Enjoy the book. Great weekend. Thank you. Thank you. you too. Bye, guys. It's a great community to be a part of. Lucky to have the resources from a, a big team of people that are all pushing towards a pretty cool thing here.